Good evening. Thank you for being here tonight. My name is Dr. Gabrielle Balan. I am a pediatrician at Riverside University Health System. I am so excited to be part of the amazing efforts put forth to create a better future for the children of Riverside County. I was born and raised in Marina Valley, so I know this county well, and I know its potential. Over the years, I've witnessed firsthand the tough situations our youth face. Did you know that 6% of our kids who attend public school are homeless? Or that 18% of kids are living in food insecure households? Or that 22% of kids are living below the federal poverty threshold? Just so you know, that's 2% above national average across the United States. 2% doesn't seem like much, but 2% of kids in Riverside County equals to 10,000 children. What comforts me when I read these statistics is that there is a team of pediatricians here at Riverside University Health System that sees beyond the numbers, from the receptionists to the schedulers, the nurses and physicians. We understand that children are more than numbers or the insurmountable odds stacked against them. They are young people who have their whole lives ahead of them and need adults like us to see them as individuals who deserve the best opportunity at life. Here at RUHS, we see about 700 to 800 patients per month, or 9,000 per year. Each one of these children who come through any door at our many locations is seen as an individual ready to activate their best opportunities at a healthy life, which in turn affects their grades in school, and their relationship with friends and families. Our commitment goes beyond what you traditionally think of pediatrics. Here at RUHS, we have partnered with FIRST Five to deploy the Healthy Steps Program, a national program aimed at improving screening for developmental, behavioral, or social determinant of health concerns to improve the health and well-being of children with an emphasis on children from low-income families. In addition to some of these resourceful programs, I get to hear and see stories of our staff going above and beyond to provide the highest model of care. I saw one of our physicians dressed in full personal protective equipment, consulting with the family in the pouring rain as the dad held an umbrella out the car door to keep her dry. Finally, when we were faced with the challenge of a worldwide health crisis that threatened to halt the essential care families need, our team stepped up and answered the call of innovation. Our medical staff immediately started to create rapid testing sites on our campus so that those seeking results or even needing mandatory surgeries could get quick answers. The rate in which telehealth and tent visits were created was beyond our imagination. But we did it because we are so committed to making sure that we find new and innovative ways to deliver care. Even with all these great feats in 2020 alone, the staff and I admit we cannot change lives on our own. Thanks to your generous donations, we know we have partners to invest in our kids and to carry out the mission we believe in so much. From the bottom of our hearts, we thank you for helping us reach some of the most vulnerable kids in our state. Before I go, I wanted to leave you with some well wishes. We all know that 2020 has been an adventure to say the least. We may not know what tomorrow brings, but we can rest in the fact that our community at its core is good, and that we have done our best to ensure a brighter future. You all represent that here this evening. We wish you a happy holiday and a better new year. On behalf of all the pediatricians here at RUHS, welcome to the family, a family where our kids always come first. <laughs>